Hi, I'm David Baxter. And I'm Kasha Thompson. And welcome to Cabarrus This Week. And this week, we're in the fog. Oh, we're in the night. Because we're going to be talking about the Terra Toss Terror. Disc Golf Tournament. Oh, it's coming up. Oh, and we've got a lot of other information. So grab that pen and paper so you can write that contact info down. But if you miss something, don't worry about it. We'll give you a web address and an email address at the end of the show. We start this week under a black light in celebration of the Terror Toss Disc Golf Tournament. The Glow in the Dark Tournament will be held on Friday, October 25th at North Cabarrus Park in Concord from 8 to 10 p.m. Participants are encouraged to dress up if they want to compete in the costume contest. All ages are welcome and prizes will be awarded. The first 20 pre-registered teams will receive a custom Innova Glow Disc for each team member. David has a sample of that. Prizes will be awarded for first, second, and third place. The tournament costs $25 per team and increases to $35 if participants do not register by October 24th. The Terror Toss will be held at North Cabarrus Park from 8 to 10 p.m. on Friday, October 25th. And to learn more or to register, visit cabarruscounty.us slash reserve partner. Enter the search phrase Terror Toss into the class search or call 704 704- Well, the fun doesn't stop there. Enjoy a night of dancing and socializing at the Friday night Halloween party and dance. And that's at the Concord Senior Center on Friday, October the 25th from 6.30 until 10 p.m. Now, the free dance features live music from the Barely Balanced. Okay, food and drinks will be sold at the event. For more information on the Halloween party and the dance at the Concord Center, and Friday, October the 25th, all you got to do is call 704-920-3484. If you love to run, one of the area's favorite fall races is right around the corner. It's the jack o lantern Jaunt Road Race, which will be held on Saturday, October 26th at Franklis Park. The one-mile fun run and walk begins at 5 p.m. and the 5K starts at 5.30. If you haven't registered yet, the price is $23 for the 5K, $10 for the fun run walk, and $70 for families. You can register online at sportoften.com to learn more about the jack o lantern Jaunt Road Race on Saturday, October 26th at Franklis Park. Call P- Perry Gabriel at 704-920-2701 or visit cabarruscounty.us slash events. All right. Now, are you looking for a safe way to celebrate Halloween with your children? Well, if so, bring them to the Halloween Howler. And that event is on Saturday, October the 26th from 6 to 9 p.m the Academy Rec Center in Concord. Now, the event's going to feature fun games, candy, face painting, all sorts of cool things. So for more information on the Halloween Howler event on Saturday, October the 26th at the Academy Rec Center, just call Concord Park and Rec at 704-920-5600 or visit concordnc.gov. Libraries aren't just for bookworms, Mm. though they are appreciated. If you love a video game, then there's an event for you to check out. It's the We Open Play, held on Saturday, October 26th at the Concord Library. The event runs from 2 to 4 p.m. Participants will be able to play Wii Sports, Guitar Heroes, Smash Brothers Brawl, and other games. For more information on the Wii Open Play event at the Concord Library on October 26th from 2 to 4 p.m., Call 704-920-2050 or visit cabarruscounty.us slash events. Hey, now, if you saw a spider crawling on my chest, that was real. <laughs> I was like, whoa, what's that? Okay. <laughs> Little sidebar there. Okay, hold on. Now, Christmas is here before you know it, okay? I know we're out here in the Halloween. You wouldn't think about it, but hey, there's not a better way to get ready for Christmas than to go to Christmas Made in the South show. you got to plan ahead. Absolutely. Now, the nationally acclaimed event is going to be held on October 25th through the 27th at the Cabarrus Arena. And you can stroll through the aisles, get all kinds of decorating ideas, and you can look at get gifts and crafts. And there'll also be an art and gourmet food there. Now, ticket costs only $6 for adults and children 12 and younger get in for free. On Friday and Saturday, the event takes place on 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and on Sunday from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. For more information on the Christmas Made in the South, and again, that's on October 25th through the 27th at the Cabarrus Arena, visit cabarrusarena.com or just call 704 920 
3976. Love a good ghost story? Well, some of the creepiest, scariest, and most unforgettable stories can be heard at the walking tour of Haunted. Haunted? Haunted! Mount Pleasant <laughs> on Saturday, October 26th from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. Mm. To participate, purchase a ticket at the Eastern Cabarrus Historical Society Museum located at 1100 North Main Street in Mount Pleasant. Adult tickets are $5 and students are $3. After enjoying hot cider and donuts, tour participants will take a comfortable walk at your own pace on College Street. Volunteers will share ghost stories at six homes on the tour. The stories are each based on facts that have been passed down from generation to generation. Ooh. For more information on the walking tour of Haunted Mount Pleasant on Saturday, October 26th from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m., Call 704-436-6612 or visit echsm.net. Now, we just wanted to take one quick little moment to remind you, you know, because it is fall and some things have to come to the end, and that means the paddle boats and the miniature golf at Frank Cliss Park is going to operate for the last time this season on Sunday, October the 27th. Farewell, paddle boats. Yeah, so if you want to get there, rush out there. Get on those paddle boats. It's such beautiful weather. It'd be great to do that. Mm -hmm. Now, the paddle boats and miniature golf, of course, will reopen in the spring of 2014. Now, just because these activities are ending for the season doesn't mean that there aren't a lot of other fun activities to do. You can just check out that list of activities at Cabarrus County Active Living and Parks by visiting cabarruscounty.us slash parks or just call 704-920-3484. An amazing gospel event is coming to the Cabarrus Arena on November 2nd. It's Power of the Cross Thousand Voices featuring both old and contemporary gospel music. The event is free, but donations are accepted. Parking is $5 per car. Power of the Cross runs from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. The motivation for a thousand voices began as a four-hour theme service praise to God, but has grown big time over the past several years. For more information about the Power of the Cross on November 2nd at the Cabarrus Arena, visit CabarrusArena.com or call 704-920-3976. Now, death isn't something people like to talk about, but it's an important situation to plan for. Now, there's a program called Exit Strategies, and that's going to be held on October the 28th at the Concord Library from 6 to 7 p.m. Now, Sarah Marvel of the Cabarrus Memorial Gardens is going to talk about funerals, cemeteries, cremation, and the importance of planning ahead and getting your affairs in order. Now, the program's free and it is open to the public. Now, to learn more about the Exit Strategy event on October the 28th from 6 to 7 p.m. at the Concord Library, just call 704-920-2050 or visit cabarruscounty.us slash events. Now, taking a different path here. Okay. Are your children interested in horses? <laughs> if <laughs> that is different. That's if so, it. if so, consider taking them to a meeting of the Saddles Up 4-H Club on October 27th at Ollie Bubba Farms. Children ages 10 to 12 are invited to learn about the care, health, and study the horses and horse show. Participants do not have to own or ride a horse to participate. The event runs from 3 to 6 p.m. For more information about visiting the Saddles Up 4-H Club on October 27th from 3 to 6 p.m. at the Alibaba Farms in Concord, call 704-786-9223 or visit cabarruscounty.us slash events. Now, starting in November, you can learn and celebrate the parks in Cabarrus County, which North North Cabarrus is a really it's nice a great one. one. Frank Lisk is a great one. Oh, yeah. Camp okay. T. and Spencer oh, with absolutely. the cabins. Oh, those are all great. Now, these park history days, you can find out all about the histories. This is on Saturday, November the 2nd, and that's going to be at Frank Lisk Park in Concord. Now, I'll take a behind-the-scenes look at the history and also the facilities of the park. You'll in the daytime. It'll be much easier to see <laughs> the facilities of the park. easier. That's true. Yeah. Now, you can learn how each park came to be and the special amenities that make them really unique. Now, hot chocolate and coffee, hey, that'll be also served at that time with each session. And pre-registration is required because of the coffee and the hot chocolate. You know, you don't want to miss that out, okay? So is required by Thursday prior to the event. Now, Park History Days is free and it runs from 10 to 11 a.m. Now, the Park History Day at Frank List Park is on November the 2nd. 
And that is the first of three sessions which continue all the way into January. To learn more information or to register to cabarrascounty.us slash reserve partner, type in Park History Days into the class search, or you can call 704-920-3484. Have you ever wondered if you have the skills needed to survive without modern supplies? Hmm. Probably not <laughs> David, hey. but... That's why he's going to the planning event. That's right. Because <laughs> he could not make it out of the woods. <laughs> a two-part series will put your survival skills to the test. The Earth Skills class will be held on Saturday, November 9th from 1 to 3 p.m. And on Monday, November 11th from 5 to 7 p.m. And this is at Camp T. and Spencer mm -hmm. Park. So it's a two-part series. The class, which is open to people of all ages, costs $10 and covers both days. Instructors will teach you how to make a shelter, build a fire, and construct weapons. Wow. That's pretty different. So get, get prepared, I guess. I, I'm guessing this is survival right. weapons. Right, not, right. Yeah. You must pre-register by Thursday, November 7th. To learn more or for more information or to register for the Earth Skills class at Camp T and Spencer Park, visit cabarrascounty.us slash reserve partner. Enter the phrase Earth Skills into the class search or call 704-920-3484. Now, if you love a good mystery, your skills are needed to solve one on a Thanksgiving crime with the Harvest Who Done It. Now, join park rangers at North Cabarrus Park, okay, on Saturday, November the 9th to find the culprit who stole a Thanksgiving turkey. Oh, somebody stole my turkey. Oh, no. You'll be able to interview suspects. <laughs> You're thinking of WKRP, That's aren't you? I, uh, and gather clues. Now, the Who Done It event is from <laughs> 1 to 2 p.m. and is open to all ages, and the event only costs two dollars. Now, to learn more, to register for the Harvest Who Done It event in North Cabarrus Park on November 9th, visit CabarrusCounty.us/reservepartner. Enter Who Done It into the class search box, or call 704-920-3484. And we're not going to be throwing turkeys out of a helicopter. No, so. but I bet a good place to check would be the refrigerator. That's true. That's right. That'll be a good one. That's it. Now, I know, I know we've had a lot of information on today's show and a lot of smoke and a lot of things going on, flying around in the background. But if you missed any of the contact information, all you got to do is go to cabarrascounty.us and uh, there's a little search box and you can just put that topic in the search box, find out what you're looking for. Hey, if you have any problems with it, just pop us an email at channel22 at cabarrascounty.us. And we want you to sign up for our newsletter. It comes once a week. You just go to the top right side of our website, click on the little newsletter sign up box, type in a little bit of information, or you can text CTW to 22828. And of course, please follow us on Facebook and Twitter. We've got all kinds of great information and tips. It's got interactive things with our website and with CTW and other programs that we have. And it's all on our Facebook and Twitter sites for Cabarrus County. And also, if you have family or friends that don't have Time Warner Cable, can't watch us on Channel 22 or 97.2, then uh, just, or maybe you just want to watch it when you get a chance. Well, just go to our web address, which is cabarruscounty.us. Scroll down in the lower left to see a video screen right below it. It says more Channel 22 programs. Click on that. And at that point, all the different thumbnails pop up for all the different shows we do. And you can watch them at your leisure. And I tell you what, you got to come on out here, get a team together, or maybe just individuals, come to the Terra Toss North Cabarrus Park. Hey, they even have a costume contest. Yes, hopefully you can find better costumes than the ones we're wearing today. <laughs> right. But this is a lot of fun. So you got to come is. out and enjoy it. Have a good time. And until next week, you have a great week. David, I see dead people. <laughs> what? You just had spouters on me, that's all. <laughs>